All right, Sarah, so we'll see your swing here next to Annika. So you too, kind of like Les there, have a real big shoulder turn. Ooh, boy. Yeah, see, you can almost see your back up here, can't you? All right, so there's a big, big shoulder turn. All right. And see, interestingly, the tour players don't turn quite that much. See what I mean? Her left shoulder socket is right about here. It's definitely inside her right knee. But you don't see you see the side of her torso, right? We can see the top of your shoulder blades there on the back of your shoulder blades. And it's a little different too the way your head went down, but it's very similar. Thanks, hon, you can just put on that mat again. And then it's very similar here the way that your right leg stayed inside that line right there. That uh, right leg was good and braced. And on the downswing now, they shift their weight back forward to their front foot. Yep, and so you too there, Sarah. Nicely back toward your front foot. And then your arms are pretty well extended. But notice this. See how there's some daylight between your forearms? Yeah, let me get a little clearer picture here of somebody else. There's Curtis Strange. Your dads will remember him. There you go. See how there's no daylight between his forearms? Any tour player we look at. There's Kelly Robbins, that tour player I showed Leslie. So right through here, you're not going to see any daylight between their forearms at that point. So you're accustomed to apparently kind of leaving the face open a little bit through impact. And then and then you see as a result, so your glove hand, it's a little bit hard to see in the daily there, but your glove hand is on top of your right hand. Right through there. So your glove is still on top, whereas you see very much their glove hand is underneath their right hand. Does that make sense? So that's a little bit of a difference there too, Sarah. But then when you finish, like the tour players, because of that good shoulder turn back, you know, I, I probably almost too much shoulder turn. You really turn your shoulders through real well here. So again, we see the back of your torso, whereas here you would see more the side of their torso quite often. So yeah, you definitely have a big turn, you know, no doubt about that. And then when you finish, you're in good balance there. So that's nice to see. All right. But yeah, your legs are good and solid there on that back swing and through the downswing pretty well, yeah like the tour players, but I would almost say that's almost too much shoulder turn. But, you know, you know your game better than I do, so I wouldn't tell you to work on that quite yet.